Today in the Madden 19 Team Builders, we have ourselves the AFC All-Stars Team Builder. And again, it is just like the NFC one where it's all the top rated players at their respective positions in the game day one. Link to the actual team builder will be in the description down below. But for right now, let's get into the AFC All-Stars team builder. Starting off with the offensive line, I gotta say compared to the NFC All-Stars team, this is actually a step down, I'm not gonna lie. At left tackle, we have Russell Okung. At left guard, we have, um, I'm, again, look, out of respect from a man on the Raiders, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that name, but that card art is amazing. Marquise Pouncey at 88 overall at center, Marshall Yonda, Team Diamond 89, and Jack Conklin, 88 heavyweight. So we got two Team Diamonds and three heavyweights on here. And compared again to the NFC team, this is a bit of a step down but at tight end i gotta say this is where it's a step up because you have travis kelsey 91 overall and delaney walker compared to the nfc's vernon davis veteran and team diamonds greg olsen the overalls aren't that much of a big difference until you get to the backup where delaney walker's a 90 vernon was an 86 but still this is actually pretty good. Now your offensive weapons in the AFC is gonna be just a bit different than it was in the NFC. For the AFC, again, I wanna hear from you guys in the comment section down below what you think personally is a lot better. In the AFC day one, the wide receivers are gonna be Coralite, Antonio Brown, DeAndre Hopkins, Team Diamonds, Jarvis Landry, uh, Core Elite, AJ Green, and Flashback Pierre Garcon. But at running back, you have Le'Veon Bell, Melvin Gordon, and Lamar Miller. The running back's a lot better in the A. a, 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 a I can't fucking speak. In the AFC, your running backs are going to be a lot better. In the AFC as well, the quarterbacks, well, take your pick on this one because you have Team Diamonds, Tom Brady, and technically number two would be Tom Brady again at an 88 overall. But then there's Baker Mayfield, the gauntlet version of Baker Mayfield. Comparing to Matthew Stafford and Aaron Rodgers, though, I don't know, Baker may be the better option because he's mobile and he can throw. And then at fullback, you have another San Diego Charger in Lorenzo Neal. He's the, probably the best fullback in the game day one. If not, he is the best. Defensively, again, compared to the NFC, I need to hear from you guys because this is like flip-flops everywhere. It's so weird. I don't like the AFC secondary at all because at free safety, you have Kevin Byard, who's only an 84 overall, and strong safety ever Rashad Jones who's an 88 compared to Adrian Amos Amos is a lot better in my opinion and free safety you've got Earl Thomas you've got Ronnie Lott so eh, I don't know but linebacking core you got Jadavian Clowney Danny Trevathan Ted Hendricks and Avery Williamson as your linebacker so again compared to the NFC AFC is kind of neck and neck right there but middle linebacker is going to be the step down now at cornerbacks this this pretty much beats the NFC in my opinion. You've got Team Diamonds, Jalen Ramsey, Chris Harris Jr., Champ Bailey. You got Stephon Gilmore, Flashback, and Tredavious White, Team Diamonds. At the defensive line, you got Bruce Smith, Geno Atkins, 89 overall, and JJ Watt, who again somehow has an 89 overall, but still defensively on the D-line, the AFC pretty much reigns supreme. And again, if you do care about the specialist, your punter's Marquette King and your kicker's Justin Tucker. I think this is the best pair compared to the NFC. Now again, I will say guys, for the AFC, the offensive line is not my favorite. The tight ends are pretty much actually a little bit better compared to the NFC. But your offensive weapons though are actually really good. Running back, quarterback, you've got great options there. At wide receiver, eh, I don't know. And linebackers, safeties are just like... I really can't even say they're not the best, but I will say the right outside and left outside linebackers are really good for the AFC and at corners. I mean, the AFC pretty much takes the cake, but I want to hear from you guys in the comment section down below. What do you think of the AFC All-Stars and what players on here are you going to go for day one? Let me know in the comment section down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Take it easy, y'all. Have a safe one. Peace.